It's not quite the wild backstage antics we'd hoped when you sent five millionaires on tour together, but credit to Harry Styles for dangling himself by a dressing gown in this hilarious vine. Oh Harry, we thought you'd been all creative, but it turns out your ex Mrs Cara Delevingne and her wifey Rita Ora did that ages ago. But still, not as embarrassing as Niall Horan trying to do his high pitched vocal warm ups. <laughs> God, and people say they can't sing. We often wonder whether celebrities read all those mean tweets they get sent, or if they just pay someone to read them for them. Well, Jimmy Kimmel's done some research with quite funny results. I've never seen the fuss with Russell Brand. He's a hairy, non-funny <laughs> Dear No Doubt, the only thing in doubt is whether your music makes me want to puke or kill myself and then puke. Sincerely, Everyone. I already know when I get pregnant, I'm gonna pull a Jessica Simpson and gain 598 pounds. God help us if Talisa found out what people thought about her on the internet. Michael Douglas and Matt Damon have had to do some on-screen snogging. And here's what Michael had to say about his lock of lips with Mr. Damon. Once you get that first kiss in, you are comfortable. Matt and I didn't rehearse the love scenes. We said, well, we've read the script, haven't we? The hardest thing is that everyone is a judge. I don't know the last time you murdered someone or blew anyone's brains out, but everyone has had sex. And probably even this morning, which means everyone has an opinion on how it should be done. It's probably okay not to be good again off of Matt Damon when you're Mike Douglas. Just saying. <laughs>